approve the deal? Oh yeah, it's, uh, it's actually an interesting question. And to be honest, uh, yes, I believe that they will reach an agreement uh, a few days before the end of the month, uh, because uh, honestly, it's been just taking too much time uh, uh, and uh, people are genuinely fed up about the whole process uh, on both sides, really. And additionally, of course, it has been a, uh, a negative impact for the whole uh, UK economy. So it's uh, actually in the interest of both sides to reach an agreement. So I'm uh, quite positively minded, to be honest. I think um, it's been a few years, it's been three years since uh, this has been happening. Uh, it's a miracle that there is the potential of a deal on the table, but um, who knows what happens in the political will powers. Um, whether he gets it through Parliament, I'm not really sure, uh, because a minority government historically has not been really able to pass too many things. Um, but I hope the will of the people uh, will prevail. Yeah, this is the question everyone's asking at the moment. It's about taking back control. Uh, this is the mantra uh, I think that Brexit was based on. Uh, can Boris do this with as little compromise as possible? I don't know, the verdict's out. If he can persuade enough members of Parliament to vote, then I reckon we should see a deal, but uh, the numbers, from what I can see, don't really stack up. Either way, I think the whole thing, uh, once we get the whole thing behind us, uh, we will all be relieved. The question, I think, at the end of the day, though, is can British politics really exist after this?